Hi, I'm Rick Twaniak, and I am speaking to you from Cisco Live 2016 in Las Vegas. And I have with me today Terry Slattery, who is one of our, who is the number one CCIE, the first CCIE external uh, to Cisco. And Terry hung out at the DevNet Zone and uh, this weekend to do one of our Springboard coding events. So I wanted to talk to Terry a little bit about what he saw there and and what his experience was. Terry, what? Did well, Rick, what we were doing is um, Cisco had put together this Springboard event, which is a, a really cool hands-on environment where we got to use some of the APIs and use Python programming and use Postman, which is a, an add-on to the Chrome browser, to actually program the network. And we also got to interface with Cisco Spark and Cisco's Tropo interface, which goes out to telephone system and can send SMS messages, all kinds of interesting things. So we were able to interact with the network and able to interact even with ourselves and our, our coworkers by building Spark Rooms, putting messages in Spark Rooms, and then calling phones and sending message, SMS messages. It was pretty cool. Very cool, uh, Terry. And, and would this be something that you'd recommend for all CCIEs? Oh, absolutely, for CCIEs. Um, I recommend it for pretty much everyone. The network is moving more towards automation. Um, the days of the CLI, yeah, I, I think the networks are getting big enough and complex enough that we're going to have to start move away from using the CLI, which is a box by box programming of the network. We're going to have to treat the network as a system. And in treating it as a system, we need to program a whole bunch of boxes at the same time. We're actually programming policy. Um, there was an interesting comment somebody made to me this week that the CLI is like assembly language programming. So we're using the CLI, which is like assembly language programming, for programming the network. And what we need to do is to step it up and move to like C programming and then scripting. And scripting, I think, is really where we need to be. And using some of the automated tools for programming the network and program by policy, not by assembly language. That's a great analogy, Terry. Thank you very much. And uh, so for all of you, uh, come to the DevNet Zone. Uh, when we're in your area at Cisco Live, or come to see us online at developer.cisco.com. Uh, Thanks, everybody.